Hi, this is Jeff from Serious Learning, and in this screencast, I'll show you how to create animated title screens for Articulate Replay. Mike Anders did a great screencast on how you can create uh, title pages and summary pages, course objective pages, uh, based on an image and insert that in replay. And he did that in PowerPoint, and I thought, wait a second, I can also save my slide deck as a video in PowerPoint. So. Would, it, would I be able to create an animated title slide as well? And I tried it. So I set up a, a, my slide uh, just like Mike did. Um, I went to the design uh, section, page setup, selected 16 by 9 because it's the format of my screen, uh, which I'm going to be recording. And I actually doubled those uh, width and height sizes. So I get a really large screen video uh, that will probably scale down and not up so it will keep its sharpness and crispness and not get all pixelated but because it's smaller than the rest of the video that I'm recording. So once I've set that up I created my title slide, put in my logo and added animations to the logo and the title and I did the same thing on the slide with the course objectives, put some animations on that. I also played with some slide transitions because I wanted to see if that gets picked up in the video uh, that PowerPoint saves. So I've got a pan here and I've got an actual fade here. So what that's going to look like is like this. My slide will fade up, my logo will appear, the title will appear, and after a couple of seconds the slide will pan and the rest of the content will come in. Pretty nice. Now, in the transition section, I actually set advanced slides to a specific amount of seconds and I remove the on mouse click because I want to control how many seconds the slides on screen for the video. Did the same thing here, so we got it to six seconds. So basically, the user has to be able to read what's on screen here. Now, when I'm done, I go to File, Save As. Save as type and select Windows Media Video right here. And I can select it and save it. Do I want to overwrite it? Yeah, sure. And what you can see in the bottom here is that uh, PowerPoint's actually creating the video, replay2.wmv. And this might take a little while, uh, but once it's done, you can actually. Uh, import that in replay. So let's take a look what that, and that, how it works. So I've opened up replay and what I'm going to do is I'm going to insert a video and there you go replay 2. Open it. It's following you. It's probably still saving. Yes it is. I'm going too fast for PowerPoint. There, it's done. Back here, now I can open it. And voila. As you can see, I now created my animated title screen plus animated course objective page. And all I have to do now is record the actual video that I want to show here. So that's it. That's how you create an animated title page and other animated content pages.